All right, Keyshawn, we're talking momentum changes. We're talking challenges won, challenges lost. You go to the ultimate tie break. What is going through your mind when you lose that challenge and it's 5-3 going in and you got you got to score? Yeah, well, I was getting to my feet a lot, just really struggling to get out. I felt like uh, maybe there were some stall calls that weren't called there, but all I can do is keep wrestling. My coach just told me to keep my mind in it the whole time. I went down, I was just thinking, I need a quick escape, and I, then I know I can take him down. I can get to his legs. Just got to finish. But uh, ended up getting the reversal instead. At the very end, walk us through what happened. Yeah, so I got to my feet at the start, just like I had the whole rest of the match, basically. And uh, had his hands out so he couldn't return me. Got the stall call. Uh, reset. I stood up. And I knew that I, there was only like 15 seconds left. So I knew I didn't have time to try to get another stall call out of it. So I had to go. I uh, went for the switch. Ended up getting the, take, the reversal, so. How big is this for you guys, um, you know, in the team race? Um, yeah, it's, the it's really important. There's a lot of uh, upsets and stuff in this tournament, but all we can do is control what we can control. Try to get the wins that we're supposed to get and make it happen. Okay, the Ohio State, Michigan. You're not from Ohio, so I don't know if that yeah. means a lot to you, but Ohio and, and Michigan kids, Malik's from Michigan, right around Ann Arbor, means yeah. a lot to him. Does that mean anything to you that Ohio State, Michigan just um, bit a rivalry? Not as much as some other Ohio natives on the team, but it's definitely a focus at our school with everything. All sports, it's uh, beat the team up north, so it's definitely a real rivalry, very intense. You had wrestled him before, right? Yeah, about a month ago. And you won pretty comfortably then, right? Yeah. What adjustments did he make and what did you have to counter his up to? I think it was really just that, that early takedown he got because I never went down in the duel. So he kind of forced me to be on bottom more than I wanted to be. And I think that's the adjustment he made. Who you got next? Uh, Ryan Blees, I think. Good luck, Virginia Tech. Thanks. Keep it rolling.